The ambassadors for the Supreme Chancellor request permission to board. Am I still in shock? Oh, oh uh, had a bit of a tough. <laughs> yes, of course. As you know, a blockade is perfectly legal. I have a bad feeling about this. Welcome, Ambassadors. I am TC-14, at your service. We are greatly honored by your visit, Ambassadors. I still have a bad feeling about this, you know. Don't center on your anxieties, Obi-Wan. Keep your concentration here and now, where it belongs. But Master Yoda said I should be mindful of the future. But not at the expense of the moment. Be mindful of the living force, young Padawan. Yes, Master. This way, Ambassadors. yourselves comfortable. My master will be with you shortly. How do you think this trade viceroy will deal with the Chancellor's demands? These Federation types are cowards. The negotiations will be short. When they finally begin, you mean? Is it in their nature to make us wait this long? No. I sense an unusual amount of fear for something as trivial as this trade dispute. Ah. Yeah. Ah. 
Over there. It's an invasion army. We have to get down to the planet and warm the Naboo. Let's stow aboard one of these ships. Let's get out of here before more droids show up. Jar Jar, we need to find somewhere safe and warn the Naboo of this invasion. Excuse me, but the most safest place would be Otagonga. It's a hidden city. Can you take us there? Uh-huh. This way. Hurry! We are going underwater, okay, Dave? Oh my warning you, Gungans no like outsiders, so don't expect a warm welcome. Oh, don't worry. This hasn't been our day for warm welcomes. Miss a back? Not again, Jaja. You are going to the bosses. You are in big doo doo this time. Eh, how woo! Is there something you want to tell us, Jar Jar? This is embarrassing, but uh, I'm afraid I might have been banished. I've forgotten. That seems like something it would have been helpful to remember. As I said, brainless. Do you mind telling us why our friend here was banished? Jar Jar, clumsy oaf! He crashed into boss's personal haver liver bungle! Mr. told you! That was an accident! Yes! Jar Jar accidentally took in his hands off the wheel to catch tasty beetles! Droid army is about to attack the Naboo. We shall no like the Naboo. We must warn them. 
Misa give a user una bongo. The speediest way to the Naboo is oh. going through the planet Core. Oh. What is to become of Jar Jar Pinks here? Mm -hmm. Be gone with him! Setting us up, all right? Going to the planet core? Bad bombing. I'm more concerned about your track record with submarines. Rest assured, you will not be driving. Yosabongo, whenever you're so ready to get a punching. will guide us. The force? Oh, no, no, no! Quick, shoot! Ah! No, no, no! We need this creature out of the way. Shoot it, Obi-Wan! a bigger fish. We're losing power. Stay calm. We're not in trouble yet. You're nonsense! Why do you also think in reason trouble? Back. Full speed ahead. Mesa told you the planet core was bad bombing. Your constant optimism is really encouraging, Jar Jar. It's toying with us. Yes, but we should still be able to harm it. We must find the queen. Ah, victory! Oh, oh, ah, ah! 
stupid chair. The Makanix has the queen! I imagine they'll be taking her to their ship. If their ship is docked in the hangar, I give them some time to intercept them. Stop right there! Are we safe now? I believe so. But who do we have to thank for our rescue? We're ambassadors oh. to the Supreme Chancellor. It's urgent that we make contact with the Republic. Do you have transports? In the main hangar. This way. You're the guy's bomb bat! Oh.
This is Her Royal Highness's ship. Are you ready to go? There's the blockade! Shield generator's been hit! There's not enough power to get us to Coruscant. The hyperdrive is leaking. <sighs> Here, Master. Tatooine. It's small, out of the way. The Trade Federation has no presence there. <laughs> Tatooine, you say? Any suggestions on where we should land? The Mos Espa spaceport seems like our best option for finding the parts we need. Mos Espa it is, then. But land on the outskirts. We don't want to attract attention. Commands that I go with you. She's curious about the planet. Orsa, are you, sir? I'm Padme, one of the Queen's handmaidens. This is not a good idea. But if the Queen wishes it. Now we need to find a mechanic selling the parts we need. Let's ask around. <laughs> I know what you need. I know what you need. Oh. Nah, I don't. Oh. Yeah. Let me guess, looking for...
Suba da Naga. I'm afraid I can't help you. I need parts for a J-Type 327 Nubian. I have 20,000 Republic Dactaries. The public credits are no good out here. I need something more real. You're a funny little boy. I'm building a pod racer. You must have Jedi reflexes if you race pods. There's big race tomorrow on Bunti Eve. You can enter my pod. Anakin. The prize credits will more than pay for the parts they need. The Force is unusually strong with him. That much is clear. He deserves better than a slave's life. The boy tells me you want to sponsor him in the race! Well, I've acquired a pod in a game of chance. I wager my new racing pod against, say, the boy and his mother. Huh? No pod is worth two slaves. The boy, then. If that's everything we need, we should make our way to the arena and enter young Anakin into the race. That's absolutely right. And a big turnout here from all the corners of the outer rim. For Granny Champio to Pixolito Sepulva. And a late entry, young Anakin Skywalker, a local boy. Remember, concentrate on the moment. Feel. Don't think. Use your instincts. I will. May the Force be with you. Yeah. 
Doesn't matter how many eyes you got when you head into the darkness of the Laguna Cave. Somehow you knew it! Bring the parts to the main hangar. I'll come by your shop later on so you can release the boy. <laughs> no! Look at all the credits we have! Now you can make your dreams come true, Annie. Pack your things. We haven't much time. Yippee! Is he to become a Jedi? Yes. What about Mom? <laughs> Son, my place is here. It is time for you to let go. I will come back and free you, Mom. I promise. Oh, Master Anakin. I should prefer it if I were a little more completed. I'm sorry I wasn't able to finish you, 3PO. Bye. Oh, my. Anakin, it's time for us to leave Tatooine. Let's hurry back to the ship. You mean I get to come with you? In your starship? If Master Obi-Wan not getting bored and leaving us here, he's a no like in Jar Jar. I don't know about that, Jar Jar. I'm sure he thinks you're charming. Hmm. Obi-Wan, muy muy grumpy Jedi. Learning something new. We're independent joy. Someone went to a lot of effort to come and hope you found what you needed. Visit again soon. Anakin, drop fish! Oh! Gooberfish! Oh! Go! Oh! Go the pickle! Ourselves to the 
young apprentice, you know what to do. Well, if we can avoid fighting any more hooded strangers, perhaps we'll actually get to Coruscant this time. Indeed. However, I believe that stranger may have been the Sith Lord. Fancy that. A personal welcome from Senator Palpatine himself. Let us quickly explain the situation in Naboo, so my people may finally be saved. Greetings, Your Majesty. Master Jedi. It is a great gift to see you. I'm anxious to hear. The Supreme Chancellor Valorum has called for a special session of the Senate to discuss the situation on Naboo. Though, I must be frank, he has little real power, and it is unlikely the Senate will act on the invasion. I believe our best option is for Her Majesty to push for the election of a new Supreme Chancellor who can take control and give us justice. Here we these transport ship once you're ready. We're an independent joint taxi service. No apps, no drivers, no problem. You ready to go? Have a smooth trip. Hope you don't get raided on the way. Ah, there you are. Are you ready to begin the meeting? <laughs> 